Hey guys, it's Callum and it's another video. I'm back again. I said there's gonna be another video out in a period of a week. And I want to talk about some stuff. Basically, next weekend I am going to get my season ticket. I might vlog it. I don't know. Uh, for Portsmouth next weekend, I am gonna go and watch the Pompey play having a Waterlooville game. They're on my channel. Let's bring up the whole J Station situation. This bloody Bell end once again. Can't keep his mouth shut. I've done one video on him before. This is my second video on him. And I thought, you know, I used to respect him back in the day. Michael McCrudden, or whatever your fucking name is. Michael McGreedy, as some people are calling you now. Very true because you're using his name for money. That's not just it. J Station is also milking it. And there's other YouTubers that are, that are milking it. And I'm not going to put his name in the title just for respect reasons. And um, there's only one YouTuber that I respect, or that I respect that I think he lived close to me at one point, or closer to me. But he lived in Bournemouth. I think he lived in Bournemouth. I might be wrong. Obviously, he's moved around a lot. I'm Alex, getting quite big at the moment. He did a video recently called YouTubers Milk XXS Tentacion. The difference between you can put someone's name in your title. There's a difference between doing that and absolutely milking them for money. It looks like that I'm Alex, YouTube demonetized quite a lot of his videos anyway. Supposedly, YouTube demonetized quite a lot of his videos anyway. YouTube have let him keep letting him monetize his videos. And obviously, you have a choice to monetize your videos. You have a choice. Obviously, if YouTube don't think they're suitable, they will demonetize them. But I'm Alex has had the chance recently. But anyway. It looks like that he's decided to demonetize his own video because of to be respectful. And uh, J Station in his video turns around and be like, "Let's hit 100k likes for his condolences." Pl in his video, plus that's not the worst thing. He gets a Ouija board and he takes the piss. And that's not that if you don't think that's bad enough. What he decides to do, he doesn't be like, "Oh, you know," he says, "Oh." Uh, us when he's driving in the car, he says about oh he's flashing off his new keys for his house. Oh, he um also Mark, Michael McGrudden in his video is sponsored by I don't know some random vape company, and he said all the money's gonna go to blah blah blah. And I don't, I don't and he makes up excuses like I don't have a choice because I need to pay for bills. Yeah, I get everyone's got to pay for bills, but at the end of the day, you're making a bloody money, mate. One video isn't gonna hurt, and plus you made four videos on the, you made four videos on him, four videos on X. He was respected in the game so much. He was respected in the game, and he has to batter him like a piece of fish in a fish and chip shop. Like it's disgusting. It is disgusting. He doesn't deserve to be on. Like it just. He was one of my favorite artists. Like uh, so many other people. So many other people. I've been listening to him for years, since I was about, I don't know, what, 19, I've been listening to him for about two, three years now, since Look At Me came out, and I thought, oh my god, that's a banger, that is a banger when I came out, and it was just a party tune around my area, it was just a, it was just a men mental tune, and like, and it took so many people off, off the floor, it was just, poosh, parties all around my area would happen, that song would be playing quite a lot, and and then obviously he released more songs over the years came out. He probably released more songs before that and he did, I think, through SoundCloud and stuff like that. So there's probably more respect there's more people that respect him more. And obviously he had um, a funeral thing that he had a funeral I think that took place in LA. Um he had two funerals but one in his hometown, I think one in LA. I'm not trying to be a dickhead about this video, but like, I'm really just trying to get these cunts off YouTube. Like I'm trying my best. Um, obviously there's only one thing that I can do, and only other people that could do it is PewDiePie. Obviously I'm Alex. That gets 100 to 150k views. Um, and then obviously PewDiePie needs to do loads of videos on Jake Paul and other porn case and all these people would need to do videos on them just to get them off YouTube. But it's it won't happen because I don't want to get sucked into drama. Only reason why I'm doing this video is because I'm pissed off generally pissed off that people don't have the right and the decency to keep their mouth shut. And I said in my last video about, oh, I was joking, and I'm not joking here, I do want to fight someone now because this video has just wrapped me up. If J Station, I know he wouldn't answer because he's a bell end and he's a squeaky little twat that can't keep his mouth shut and I would like to knock him out. 
I would all love to knock him out. Obviously, Joe Weller said the same thing. So, Joe Weller, you know, whatever. But I'll, I'll, I'll come at you, Joe. <laughs> but no, Matt's serious again. J Station, bloody respond to this video, you fucking din what? I'm going to edit it a little bit. Not a lot. But I'm going to edit. I'm going to chop it. Cut it up, yeah, but like a normal one edits. Rest in peace, XXX, 10 times yawn. Thank you guys for watching. I know it seems like I'm being disrespectful to X, but please subscribe because I want these people to be put down a notch and I want my channel to grow. I want this channel to be rolled around people I love, people I care for, the community I care about, and I want you to do care about. The whole McGrudden thing, Michael McGrudden, Went or whatever, Michael McGreedy, whatever you want to call him, he said, oh, X was a fan of the show. No, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. He took the piss out of your show. He came on your show at one point. And I think that video I took down. He came on, had an interview, and, it got, and I think he got took down by X's uh, company because X told him to. See you guys in the next one. Subscribe. Rest in peace. You are a legend in the rap game. Especially one of his newest ones. That was on one of his newest albums. And apparently there was rumours of a new album coming out very soon because he was going to be going on tour introducing a new album. But apparently the weekend coming up to before he the day he died, that weekend just coming up, he was supposed to be starting a tour, I believe. But I'm not going to add any any music to this video like my normal videos. I'm just going to edit it. See you guys in the next one. Peace.